Kingsman The Secret Service is probably one of my favorite action movies of 2015. Holy crap was this movie amazing, okay? And it, it, it really is just pays homage to old school spy movies. They even have a little inside joke in there. It's like, I don't really like spy movies nowadays. They take everything way too seriously. There's no, there's no limit of fun anymore. This movie is all but fun, okay? It's all but fun. Simple Plot is about Colin Firth, who is a spy among spies, in this group called the Kingsmen. They dress very well, they're casual, they're awesome at killing people, whooping people's asses, and taking those names. And Colin Firth's character gets to um, in, you know, train this younger recruit 17 years after his father was actually killed on a mission. So now the son is trying to join the ranks of the Kingsmen. And he's going to teach him how to be a well-distinguished spy, dress nice, and be smart about your appearance. All the while, Samuel L. Jackson's character is planning, plotting this microchip device or like a, I want to say, you know those, those chips you put inside your phones and shit? I forget what the name of it's called, but you know what I'm talking about. SIM cards. There we go. He has an idea to plant SIM cards in the people's necks. And when the time is right, activate said SIM cards to cause mass chaos and annihilation, basically. And the Kingsman has to stop him. This movie is just bad ass. I ain't never seen action shot this well before. I've seen a lot of action movies, okay? Matthew Vaughn knows how to shoot action. Damn, he knows how to shoot action. Colin Firth. Dude, I read that thing you wrote. Nobody wants to see me do action movies. Bullshit, okay? Do more shit like this, okay? Stop doing all those boring-ass dramas that I don't like from you. Do good action movies like this, okay? Stop taking yourself too seriously, okay? That's one reason why I, stopped, I haven't reviewed anything you were in, because I didn't care to, because I couldn't sit through them anymore. <laughs> <laughs> so, this is like my very first review of a Colin Firth movie that I actually enjoyed. So, hey, you did a great job in this. So, hats off to you. That young recruit that he has to train, he's awesome. I, I don't know where he's from or um, what he's done yet. I have to look him up after this video. He's awesome. Okay, he's an awesome actor. He's going to go a long way in this movie. Samuel L. Jackson, who talks like this. And he has a lisp like this in his mouth. Yeah, boy. <laughs> Look, it's Samuel L. Jackson with his tongue behind his tooth. His teeth. Pretty much. But he does awesome. He does awesome. He's awesome as a bad guy. Good guy. Whatever. It's Samuel L. Jackson. He's more... He's like the second most charismatic per, manic person ever. Besides Dwayne Johnson. And sometimes Will Smith. When Will Smith is trying to be better as opposed to being an asshole but yeah the action is shot well the CGI looks good the CGI looks damn good and I, I love the the fight between um, the young dude and this chick that works with Samuel L. Jackson and she doesn't have any legs she has legs but she doesn't have feet so she has like these little uh, walker crutch things I, forget, I don't even know the name of them but of course they're a little bit tweaked and they got swords at the bottom of them and it's an R-rated movie, so you can kind of guess what she could do with those sword things, right? Yeah. The fact that this movie is R-rated is even more badass because they actually made an R-rated spy movie. It made it work. It made the comedy work. It made the violence work. You saw somebody in half. It's not a lot of blood squibs. Ain't no blood squibs at all. He just gets sawed in half. It's almost like a PG-13 sawed in half. But, yeah. It's awesome. If you have not seen Kingsman yet, you really should because uh, you're doing yourself a disservice not watching this movie. Anyways, I will give Kingsman The Secret Service an A+. This is a fucking awesome treat. Especially from a February movie. And yeah, 
but it's coming from Matthew Vaughn, so I wouldn't I wouldn't be surprised if it wasn't if it wasn't good. I mean, I wasn't good. If it was good and not this, ah, whatever. You get what I'm trying to say. <laughs> ah, I'm gonna confuse myself there for a minute. Anyway, so let me know what you guys think about Kingsman down below. Did you like it? Did you hate it? I will catch you guys in the next one.